hey y'all welcome back to the channel so in today's video y'all are going to be coming along with me to my appointment self-care edition um i just feel like i just really need to take care of myself today just because life has just been kind of not how i want it to be and i feel like today will help me get in a better mood like i haven't been like in a sad mood because i know things are going to get better for me like you know i'm not about to be sad about it because the longer i'm sad about it it, it just it just doesn't work out like my mood is just going to affect like everything and i just don't want that so that's why we're having a self-care day so today i'm getting a wax a facial and i'm going to get a new phone hopefully a new phone they told me i didn't need to put a down payment so hopefully i don't have to do that because if i do i don't i'm not getting another phone because I'm, I'm look uh yeah i'm not paying 800 dollars for a new phone like for a down payment at that like i'm not doing that so hopefully a new phone and then we're just gonna see what else we can get into today and today's like very gloomy and i was just like thinking to myself i'm not about to let the weather affect my mood you know how we are like it's sunny outside like oh it's so pretty let's have a good day let's go out do things and then when it's gloomy rainy i'm like okay look i'm staying in the house and i'm sleeping all day but i'm not about to let this weather affect my mood because it is gloomy today and let's go out and have fun i don't care what the weather's like let's go out and have fun but anyway so it is currently 9 25 uh, for me to get there on time i think i need to leave like now so i'm gonna put the address in my phone so i'm gonna be getting there at 10 9 appointments at 10 30. uh i think the facial is first before the wax i kind of want to do opposite wax first and then facial so i can relax you know but we'll see when we get there i'll just ask it because the same girl who's doing my wax is the same person who's doing my facial so we're just gonna see when we get there I just made it i literally couldn't find it but it's like ducked off in like the uh, like a tiny corner of like a shopping center but we found it i'm here the appointment's at 10 30 it's currently 10 10 um so i do have to check in i think i'm gonna go ahead and check in wait before i check in i need to find a mask because i think i have to wear a mask inside and i don't know if i have one in here so we're gonna find one right quick so i found a mask i was looking all over the car i was in a trunk and then i was looking everywhere but we found one it's like if they if i don't find one maybe they'll have one in there but whatever we're not taking no chances so we're just gonna wear one um it said on the booking site that they do like take covid 19 precautions so we're gonna see um but for some reason it only has my facial on here oh okay i thought i did a diamond plane facial but good i didn't want that um so it has my appointments hold on so this is what it looks like okay it's loading my phone is not charging my phone is on 62 <sighs> so it has my facial and my wax both on here on my upcoming appointments but my facial says confirmed and then my wax says accepted so i don't know and then my facial says check in so i don't know what's going on but i'm about to check in and see what's going on but i'll just ask her when i get in there like hey because like i booked her for my thing Okay, am I checked in? I don't like this. It's not. Okay, it says checked in. It says to wait in the wait by the lobby. So we're gonna walk there and go see.
delectable tea or deadly poison. I mean, where the fuck should I really even start? I got hoes that I'm keeping in the dark. I got my niggas cross the street living large. Thinking back to the fact that they dead. Thought my raps were the facts, so they sat with the bars. I got two phones, one need a charge. Yeah, they twins, I could tell they ass apart. I got big packs coming on the way. I got big stacks coming out to save. I got Lil Max with me, he the way. It's a big gap between us and the game. In the next life, I'm trying to stay paid. When I die, I put my money in the grave. When I die, I put my money in the grave. I really gotta put a couple niggas in their place. Really just slap every nigga in a race. I really might tap, fill this nigga on my face. Yo, CC, let it slap with the bass. I used to say pose with a mask and a cake. Now I'm like, nah, love, I'm good, go away. Ain't about to die with no money I done gave. I was on top when that shit meant a lot. Still on top, like I'm scared of the drop. Still on top, and these niggas wanna swap. Niggas wanna swap like it's lost in a box. I don't wanna change, cause I'm good where I'm at. Mom tied, so I'm always good where I'm at. For the junior, Jazzy, Baby J. Tell them when I die, put my money in a crib. Couple niggas kill the skull like the leg. She fuck a nigga, then she on to the next. Really living large, she ain't all with a Mac. When you niggas think it's small in the mall with a wreck. Roll with us if you really wanna get it. Go get a half a million in the sprinter. Phone ringing, bitch, no big tipple. I got the hookup and there really no limit. Dead bookies in your nigga DNA. Ricky's smile is indicated with the yay. Little nigga, just another state case. Very mind, motherfucker, Jay Bang, time to bounce. Gotta count on my allowance. You niggas snitching, so I gotta rewrite it. A nigga dripping like I got a Z and dollars. Got the trap jumping like Zane when I rebound in the mouth. And I never talk about it. The homie squad, but we all smoke the loudest. Rich niggas and I'm really being modest. Cause the way I do my deals, never treated like a artist. Don't house. Keep a D on my account. My BM six figures and I'm counting. Now I figures with the gold till I hit it. These niggas ain't living so bury mine with me. Ross got it. When I die, I put my money in a grave. I really gotta put a couple niggas in their place. Really just slapped every nigga in a race. I really might tap, fill this nigga on my face. No CC, let it slap with the bass. I used to say pose with a mask and a cake. Now I'm like, nah, I love, I'm good, go away. Ain't about to die with no money out in game. I had to use the bathroom and even the bathroom is freaking cute. Look at this. With a hot pink door and we just love pink. Like look. <laughs> this is freaking cute. I love this. I'm definitely coming back. Alright, so we are done with the facial. I didn't film the wax. I just did the facial because the wax was like easy peasy, y'all. Like I've always waxed myself at home. So I guess I was just used to like just used to what she was like what she was about to do like the only thing that really kind of hurt well was kind of like the lip area like it wasn't terrible like it's definitely pain that i can take like it wasn't terrible like me like jumping like i didn't do any of that like she's like girl you are fucking killing it like like she was really like 
she was really really easy to talk to and i love that about people because it makes the it makes it more comfortable for you like you're more comfortable like it's not awkward so everything just feel it just feels good when somebody's so easy to talk to <sighs> i'm out of breath i'm talking so fast but um yeah the facial was nice 10 out of 10 she's a 10 out of 10 like definitely gonna rec definitely going to come back uh, when it's time for another wax and whenever i just want to come do a facial she did um what's it called the jelly mask and she did the derma planning like, i caught all of that on film um so yeah i am super pumped like if she even complimented me she's like girl you have good skin like i know that's my favorite compliment ever like when people compliment me on my skin like it looks so good but we are about to go to t-mobile to see um if i can get this new phone because i do need a new phone i'm just hoping that if I'm able to get a new phone that I don't lose my footage of other things that I have in here that I need. So it's 12 o'clock. Um, let's see. T-Mobile. And then after that, I'm going to Chipotle because I want to try the Kifadilla. <laughs> I think that's what it's called. Is it called the Kifadilla? T-Mobile store 2.4 miles away. Alright, so let's go. Y'all, and then I sent... My mom is doing a tattoo party. And she's like, send me what you want. And so I sent her this. Like, I'm getting a tramp stamp. I want a tramp stamp. Like, I feel like it just fits my whole vibe, my whole aesthetic. Um, can y'all see? It says made in heaven. I'm getting that. She was like, ew. <laughs> but I was like, whatever. It's cute to me. Y'all, it's raining. Uh, I don't think I have an umbrella. I was about to say a broom. What the fuck? I don't think I have an umbrella. But to T-Mobile is right there. I was about to say Chipotle, but T-Mobile is right there. So I'm gonna see if they have somewhere close by the door to park, cause I don't think I have an umbrella. So I'm trying to get the Apple, with the Apple, the iPhone 14, but the regular one. I feel like I should have went with the Plus. I don't know, with the purple. I'm so pissed, but it's okay. We're making smart decisions. I'm not gonna like be stupid about it. Um, good financial decisions all 2023 so basically she told me so first off before I came here I talked to the people on the phone T-Mobile corporate whatever and I was like hey it's saying that I have to pay seven eight hundred dollars to get the new iPhone 14 but I'm not doing that like this phone is paid off I just want to trade it in like you know like I've been a customer of y'all for a long ass time so like what's going on why do I have to pay so much so before this uh conversation with this person a couple months ago the lady told me like your uh hold on oh the lady was like your account is kind of new so maybe that's why um but anyway so it's been four months so i was like let me just talk to these people he was like so i'm looking at your uh, account when you go in person you shouldn't be able to put a down payment so i was like okay cool he was like do you have are you do you have time to go uh, to a store and time soon I was like yes he's like okay cool if you need to have any more questions let us know so I was like okay so here I am today I come in here she looks at my account I told her what I the person on the phone told me she's like, okay I'm gonna go look at it she comes back with the phone I'm thinking it's the 14 like I'm super pumped I'm super excited she's like this is what it's gonna say on your account um she's like your trading value is 105 dollars this phone is paid off nothing no cracks or nothing I mean whatever cool so she's like, this is what it's going to say on your account. And then when you get the new phone, your bill is going to look crazy. But just wait up like a two pay period. It's like, okay, cool. I'm going to take the new phone. Cool. So she's like, um, so whole time it's an iPhone 12 in her hand. Nothing wrong with an iPhone 12. Like, don't get me wrong. But I just want, if I'm going to get like a new phone, I'm going to go like get like the newest phone. Like why, you know, get one of the old phones. So she was like, it told me like uh, putting your credentials and everything. And it told me that you would have to pay six hundred dollars for the iphone 14 and then for the iphone 12 i still had to pay money for like two hundred dollars i was like i'm not doing that like <laughs> i'm not i'm sorry this nothing's wrong with it but you know it acts crazy time to time but whatever until this phone cracks i don't want to speak it but you know then i'll get another phone i'll pay what i have to pay but for now i'm just gonna wait it out and you know continue to build my credit up you know because i have my phone bill connected to my credit so every time I put my phone bill on time, you know, it goes to my credit. So, whatever. We're about to go to Chipotle, get something to eat, and then probably go to Whole Foods and get some flowers for myself because I deserve flowers. So, that's what we're about to do. And then head home because it's raining. Yeah, we want to get out this weather because people tend to drive bad out here. So, <laughs> We 
we got it guys i'm so excited to try this so i got the quitadilla i didn't think i was gonna be able to get it i tried to order it on the app um but it wasn't letting me like choose the veggies and the cheese and so um the vinegar i'm excited um and i got the side cream but anyway so it's, it was super packed in there and I wanted to film, but I didn't want to like take up time and be in people's way. I don't want any of this to spill, so I'm gonna put that up here. So anyway, so I get up there and I'm like, can I do the steak quesadilla? She's like, yeah. So I was like, okay, cool. They were like really skimpy with these bowls and, okay, here's it. Oh, oh, y'all look, look at, oops, anyways. It looks so good like so anyways i ordered i was like can i get the steak quesadilla she was super sweet and she's like yeah she's like what size do you want it and i was like um am i able to do the cheese and the veggies i think that's what was on it when i saw it on tiktok and she was like yeah and she went to put the steak on it and like i had like a decent amount of steak on it and then the other her other co-worker was like um when you're doing a quesadilla you have to do like half steak and the girl was like is that fine i was like yeah sure i'm not gonna be mad at you for doing your job but you're a little stingy with it but whatever cool so we got it though at least we were able to get it i'm excited so I get, we just mix this up we just mix this up dang this okay i don't want nothing to spill i'm gonna cry if something spills oh my gosh look at this let me show y'all what the fuck it is falling out of the uh, the bread or whatever you want to call it, but it's falling out, so I don't know. <sighs> okay. 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 Calm down. Calm down. It's okay. Man, all my meat fell out. Okay. They're probably like, girl, hurry up. Don't worry. Okay. Hold on. Woo. Hold up. Hold the fuck up. Hmm. Bro. Bro. Damn, that shit's good as fuck. <laughs> Damn. That shit's good as fuck. Like, what the fuck? And I feel like Keith right now. Like, the way Keith does it. If y'all don't know who Keith is, y'all need to go on TikTok and follow Keith. Keith is like the best person. Like I literally look up to Keith. Like he gives me so much motivation. Like I don't only love his videos, but like I love him because he just motivates me so much. Like when he shows like where he was before today, like he's like, okay, I only have like this much in my bank account. Now look at me giving back to people. Oh my gosh, this is so good. Love yours. I think I want. Love yours. and the success hear my words and listen to my signal of distress I grew quick quick intermission why the fuck was i just sliding so t there's a girl that was so embarrassing so i was turning there's a light and i was turning to get on the highway and y'all the fucking car was sliding i was like oh my fucking god like 
that's embarrassing like what the fuck like the fact that i'm laughing about this is fucking crazy but y'all like fucking sliding while i was turning i'm like what the fuck is going on like this is why i don't need to own a car anyways yeah just quick in a minute i just have to let y'all know that but back back to the regular program <laughs> in the city and know sometimes we had less compared to some of my niggas down the block man we were blessed and life can't be no fairy tale no once upon a time but i'd be goddamn if a nigga don't be trying so tell me mama please why you be drinking all the time does all the pain he brought you still linger in your mind because pain still I don't know if I showed y'all my flowers when I was in the store, but I got some pink roses and my favorite flowers, which are the baby breath, as some fillers. I feel like this just is my vibe. Like this, this just speaks me. This is me. I love pink. I'm a fan of pink. Like pink is me. Pink is just that girl, you know. So I just feel like this is just the best thing to do. So yeah, they're so cute, you know. Spoil yourself, right? Don't wait on no man or nobody to spoil you. Do it yourself. For what's money without happiness? Or hard times without the people you love Though I'm not sure what's about to happen next I ask for strength from the Lord up above Cause I've been strong so far But I can feel my grip loosening it Quick, do something before you lose it for good Get it back and use it for good And touch the people how you did like before I'm tired of living with demons Cause they always invite him on Then being broke is better Now I don't mean that phrase with no disrespect To all my niggas out there living in debt Cash and minimal checks Turn on the TV, see a nigga Rolex And fantasize about a life with no stress I mean this shit sincerely And as a nigga who was once in your shoes Living with nothing to lose I hope one day you hear me Always gonna be a bigger house somewhere But nigga feel me Long as the people in that motherfucker love you dearly Always gonna be a whip that's better than the one you got Always gonna be some clothes that's fresher than the ones you rock Always gonna be a bitch that's better out there on the tours But you ain't never gonna be happy till you love yours This thing is a life that's better than yours Love yours This thing is a life that's better than yours Love yours This thing is a life that's better than yours Love, love, no such thing, no such thing Heart beating fast, let a nigga know that he alive Fake niggas, mad snakes, snakes in the grass Let a nigga know that he arrived